Good evening, class. Sorry, good afternoon. Good afternoon, teacher. Hello, good afternoon. How are you? I am fine. What about you? I'm very good. Thank you. It's good to see you. Thank you. All right, excellent. Um, I'm glad to see that many of you have connected. Okay, we still are missing a few people, but um, I, I think we, if I'm not mistaken, we have about five people connected, which is good. How was your day today? How was your day today? Great. It was a great day. It was a great day? Excellent. I'm glad to hear that. Okay. Um, just a moment. Okay. All right. So it seems like many are still... Um, Okay, I'm going to put in the chat. Okay. Okay, so hopefully if, uh, more people connect already um, wrote in the chat. Okay, guys and girls, welcome uh, to today's class. Thank you for connecting. Uh, and um, well, we, we don't have a list, right? But it is important that you're connected with your camera on and that you always check that your name is complete. I'm happy to see that the that everybody here has their name complete. That's wonderful. Thank you very much. Okay, so what we're gonna do right now is um, we're gonna um, start with our class. And I, wanted, I want to know if you can see my screen. No. Not yet? Okay, just a moment. How about now? Can you see my screen now? Yes. Yes. Okay. Yes. Great. Okay. So yesterday we started talking a little bit about um, how to um, ask for directions, uh, you know, uh, for different places um, in a city. Right. Um, you know, we have like the bank and the supermarket and the restrooms and blah, blah, blah. OK, so let's talk about, first of all, prepositions of place. OK, so we have prepositions of place. So we have the first word is on. So here we're talking about a specific street, for example. We can say um, the department store is on Main Street. So it means right um on the street okay so you don't have so a uh, the direction or but i said the address of the department is right on main street does that make sense yes yes okay good then we have on the corner on the corner means right in the corner right there, right? So when you have an inter intersection of a street, that would be in the um, on the corner. For example, it's on the corner of main and first. So we mean, it means right, we have like a, a so here we have um, first, the street is here is first and here is main, okay? And it's right here in the corner. 
Then we have the word across from. Across from means on the other side of the street. Okay, so we say, for example, across from um, the park. It's across from the park means that the park is on this side and on the other side of the street, we have um, whatever it is that we're looking for. Then we have next to. Next to means that, uh, that they are side by side. So it's next to the bank. So the bank is here and the other thing is right here. So they're next to each other. And finally, we have between. So between means that you have two things and whatever it is that you, you have, it's in the middle, in the middle of the two things. Do we understand? Yes. yes. Yeah, so we have the bank is between the department store and the restaurant. So it means that we have the department store here and the restaurant here. And then here we have the, the bank in the middle. Okay. Any questions so far? No. No. No questions? No. So no. Okay. All right. Well, great. In that case, um, if there is no questions, uh, we're going to um take a look at. Just give me a moment. Okay, so let's take a look at this um at this mini city or mini town. Okay. Do you see this mini town? Yes. So it's a mini town, right? Because if you notice, it, it doesn't have many streets. So here we have First Avenue, Second Avenue, and then we have Center Street, Main Street, and then we have Park Street, and that's it. Only, only five, five uh, streets, basically, five roads, okay? What can you see in this city? What can you see in the city? A bank. Huh? A bank. A department store. A hospital. A theater. Mm -hmm. Good. A supermarket. Mm -hmm. That's just uh, a Post office, a post office, mm -hmm. and a, yeah. restaurant, a restaurant, uh, a gas station, good, a park, a park, yeah, oh, yes. and what else? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Anything else? A drugstore, a drugstore, yes. Um, Okay. And a shoe store. And okay. A coffee. And a okay. coffee. Yes. And a what? A coffee shop. A oh, co coffee oh, shop. Coffee. Out, out, out coffee shop. Okay. Yeah. So we can say um a coffee shop. Yes. So it's not just a coffee. It's a coffee shop. We're gonna make sure that we say shop. Okay. Okay. So we're going to make this a little bit smaller. Oops. Uh, I don't know why it keeps on doing that. Okay, so we're going to make this smaller. And you're going to continue looking at this, at this, um, a, at this, uh, what's it called? Um, city, town, I don't know what you can call it. Um, and you're going to complete it according to what you see. You're going to complete uh, the sentences. Okay. So we have here the coffee shop is on Second Avenue. So if you see, we have the coffee shop is here and it's on Second Avenue. It's, and then you say uh, what you, what word we're going to use next to the store. 
Okay, so I'm going to share um, the, the screenshot of this. Okay, just a second. Hola, hola, Carlos. José. José, José. Sorry? Juan. Sir, do you have a question? Okay, so I just sent you a screenshot of the city and the exercise. And right now I'm also sending you the screenshot of the vocabulary that you're gonna be using, the prepositions of place. Okay, you got it? Okay. Yes. Okay. All right, so um, just to make sure that everybody is um, here going to participate. So, eh, Erika Jamilet, are you there? Yes, teacher. Okay. Okay, wonderful. Very good, very good. Eh, Jose Orantes, fíjese que solo le aparece su nombre como Jose Orantes. ¿Será posible que lo pueda poner con su nombre completo, como en el Dewey? Okay, ahorita lo coloco. Okay. Thank you. Okay. All right. Eh, Carlos Enrique, are you available? to participate? Hello, Carlos, yes, are you? Ready. Perfect, wonderful. Okay, um, so I'm going to put you guys into breakout rooms and I'll give you about six minutes to do this. Here we go. We're working in pairs. Hello, Rocío. Rocío, can you hear me? Can I hear you? Can I... Hello, Rocío. Hello. Okay. Um, are you able to participate? Are you able to participate, Rocio? Hmm. I think probably not. Walter, are you able to participate? Walter? Walter, are you able to participate? Yo la tengo en el teléfono. Sí, la verdad. Yo creo que esta era la que... De esta íbamos a sacarlo, pero no la alcanza a ver ahí. Ah, sí, 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 ya, ya, ya.
esto. Hola. <ríe> Tiene bastante distorsión ahí. Ahorita ha apagado el... Realmente. Bueno, vamos a regresar. Sí, vamos a tener que esperar, Cano. Hey, no regreso. Ah, este. No, no, no entendimos lo que íbamos a hacer en el, en el ejercicio, teacher. Porque no. como lo acabamos de conectar, no entendimos bien este, lo que íbamos a hacer. Ok, we are looking at the vocabulary that we, we learned. We learned these words on, on the corner of, across from, next to, and between. Uh -huh. Okay? Do you understand okay. the vocabulary? Ah, okay. Si están a la par, encima, o, o en otro lado. Sería, no, encima ¿verdad? no, encima no. On, uh, yeah, uh -huh. it means, it means like on the street. It means like the address is is the street. Okay. okay. So it's so. Uh, for example, the bank, the the sorry, the department store is on Main Street. La tienda de departamento está sobre la calle princip eh, principal o Main Street. Okay. Ah, uh, okay. Okay. Yeah, and okay. we have on the corner of. Right, so we right in the corner. Across from, it means like in front of, on the other side of the street. Next to, it means uh, beside. And then between means in the middle of two different things. And so now what you have to do is look at this, uh, this, um, this picture of a town or city. And according to this, complete the exercises here using the vocabulary that we have learned here using on on the corner of across from next to in between oh. okay okay yeah any questions no okay all right go for it then okay Ok, entonces vamos a... Hay que fijar la segunda imagen donde dice la de los... La venta de zapatos, dice... Second Avenue, it's... Sí, va, porque la venta... Uh, and the first center, huh? Y the parking uh, is... Uh, it's in corner of the first and center. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. ¿Qué piensan? Sí, sí. Ajá. Porque sí, no, the, the, the car station is... Eh, ¿Cómo dijera? Cross, 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 cross. Ahí yeah. sería cross, cross, cruzando the parking. Sí. Ajá. O from, 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 from the park. Across, across from no. means no cruzando, sino ah. a, al otro ah. lado de... Across from, ah, ok, al otro lado de, va. Al otro lado. Uh, uh, across uh, from, uh, ajá. Across uh, from. Uh -huh. The parking. Oh, across from the parking lot is on the corner of first and corner. center. Ajá. Uh -huh. Correcto. Sí, sí. Ahí ah, está. Okay. Excelente. And the post office is in the cuatro, the pole number four. And the post office is between to the hospital. No, ahí no dice eso. The post office is, a ver, is in the corner of the, the center and second. The center and the corner, uh -huh. Ajá, es between es to the hospital. Está la parte del hospital. ¿Sí va? Espérame que no encuentro el hospital. Ah, ajá. 
Sí, está por el post office. Uh -huh. it's, it's next to the hospital. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. It's next to. Uh -huh. The yeah. hospital, no, a la parte. De... To, uh -huh. the hospital. The, the bank is between the restaurant and the department store, uh huh. The ultimate. Mm -hmm. The bank is between to the restaurant and the department store. Mm -hmm. It's yeah. on the main street. It's on the main street, but it's on uh -huh. on main street. Uh -huh. It's on main street. It's on the main street. Data cocinado el pavo. No le venía, pero la primera. No le. O sea, como para ponerle segunda avenida que pero... segunda es que si sí, sinceramente me quedé en la nube en la nube dice Luis para mí es o antes porque el teatro está a la derecha del park main sería como lo que decía left o next después Está luego Next dice Park Main is East Park. Va, el parque es el que está también a, a la izquierda. Y Gas Station, que es la gasolinería. Vamos a ver dónde está. Está por la First Avenida. Mm -hmm. Va la, la gasolinería, la station, y en este caso, on the park on main está sobre the post offices. Vamos a ver. Office. No, hay el de post office, lo ves vos. Ah, está sobre la center, center station. Ah, vale, ¿Qué sería post center. office. Entonces, that's what we have to do. Teacher, Are we you... already finished. Yeah, that's what I was going to ask you. You're finished? Yes. Okay, perfect. I'll see you in a moment then. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. A photo. Y vemos ahí como como que qué preposición le, le puede espérame quiero ver si si logro vaya dale, dale. que no sé si para ponerlo Vaya, guacha, aquí tengo el otro, otro teléfono. Guacha. Okay, all right, guys and girls, 
We're going to be checking the answers. Um, okay. All right, so let's see if what we got here. Um, okay, so the coffee shop is on Second Street, right? Because right here, there's the coffee shop. The movie theater is? Next to, next to the park. Um, let me see where the movie theater is. I came in. On the corner of Park and Main. Mm, okay. Get ahead. Park and Main. Park and Main. Yes. Very good. On the corner of. Excellent job. On the corner of. Okay. On the corner of. Any questions? No? No. Okay, next. Let's continue. The gas station is? The gas station is? The park is? Across from, from the parking lot. Yes, very good. Across from, across from the parking lot. The parking lot. Yeah, across from the parking lot. It's good. From the parking lot first. Oh, and sorry, sorry. I me estoy, me estoy comiendo palabras aquí. Yes. Sorry, guys. <laughs> <laughs> Según yo, okay, sorry. I was in, in, a, in a different planet. Okay, hold on. So the coffee shop okay. is on 2nd Avenue. It's... it's next to the store. store. Mm. Next to yeah, it's next to the shoe store. Next to... All right. Uh, the movie theater is on the corner of Park and Main. It's... Across the park. Across the park. Across the park. Across from, from, across across from the park. From the park. The park. Across from the park. Good. The gas station is across from the parking lot. It's on the corner, the corner, of, corner of first corner and center. And center. Good. All right. Very good. It's on. It's on the corner. It's on the corner of first and center. Okay. Okay, good. Uh, the post office is on the mm -hmm. corner of center and second. Excellent. Very good. On the corner of. Mm. On the corner of. It's on the corner of uh, six, center and second. It's next to the hospital. And it's, it's next to the hospital. Next to the hospital. Mm. Yeah, yeah, very good. It's next to the office. The sorry, next to the hospital. Next to the hospital. Good. Next, the bank, the bank is is between, between the restaurant and the department store. Yeah. The bank is between the between the restaurant the and the department store. And it's on Main Street. On Main Street. It's on Main Street. Good. All right, there you go. Any questions at this moment? 
Mm. All good. It's all good. You sure? Hey. Yeah. No questions at all. Okay, so you're you're understanding this, right? Okay. Um. All right. So. Uh, what I want you to do now is continue looking at the park. Sorry, sorry, at the at the park. Sorry, not the not the park. The um the city. Okay, so city, and I want you to try to. Okay, maybe we can um. Okay, I'm going to share right now um, the conversation that we can use, okay? And we're gonna be trying to identify where these places are, okay? So we can see, for example, uh, we, can, uh, we, we can talk about the park, the drugstore, the bookstore, the hospital, and the shoe store. So you can say, where is the park? So you're gonna work with your partner, you're gonna ask, where is the park? Your partner is gonna say, it's between park and first, across from the department store, okay? So you can, um, you can ask a, your, class, your classmates where these places are in the map. Do we understand? Yes. Yes. Yeah. Okay. So um, I'm going to use the same groups. Okay. So the same partner, I'm just going to give you le um, a little bit less time. Okay. Um, hold on. Okay, I'm gonna give you about four minutes. Okay, here we go. So everybody understands what you're gonna be doing? Everybody understands? I understand. Yeah? I understand. Okay, perfect. So let's open the groups. Erika, ¿puede entrar al grupo? Okay, do we understand what to do? Uh, the bookstore is on the corner of Second Avenue uh, and and Center Street. It's across the post office. For example, the drugstore is next to the supermarket. Sí, eso sí. The drugstore is on 7th Avenue. It's next to the supermarket. Okay. The bookstore is on the corner of 2nd Avenue and, and Center Street. It's across of the post office. Yeah. The movie theater is in front of the park. Hi. You had a you had a question? 
es que no entendimos qué íbamos a hacer. Uh, you rem remember that I sent you the information in the chat? Sí. Yes. So I, I sent you right now the information in the chat about the park, the drugstore, the, the bookstore, the hospital, and the shoe store. So you're going to identify the location of those places. Yes? Does that make sense? Oscar, does that make sense? Yes. Yes, you sure? Yes. Okay, all right. So you can start talking about it. You can start asking. Entonces creo que tendríamos que hablar como un poco de, de cada cosa. ¿o? Hola. Eh, sí, creo que sí, así como decís, entonces es de ver el, el, lo que mandó. Vaya. Ajá, porque ahí está el parque. Sería una pregunta y una respuesta. Uh -huh. So all you're doing is asking, where is the, uh, so for example, where is the park? Where is the drugstore? Where is the bookstore? Where's the hospital? Where's the shoe store? And explain the location. Una pregunta, una question. Solo del parque podemos hablar. Podemos hablar de diferentes. No. Cool. Es, mandé esto en el, el grupo. ¿Sí? Sí. Ok, so you're going to be asking about where is the park, where is the drugstore, where is the bookstore, where is the hospital, where is the shoe store. ¿Ya? Yeah? O sea, tienen que identificar a dónde están estas cosas. Teacher, es parecido a lo que acabamos de estar haciendo, ¿verdad? Sí. O sea, ver en qué lugar de, de yes. están ese, eso que usted ha mandado. Sí, yes, exactamente. Okay. 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 Entonces ella, ella menciona ahí que ahí dice que el parque, ¿dónde está el parque? Uh -huh. Ahí dice pues que. Yo creo Ahora que yo pienso que. Ahí solo vamos a tener que ir, re, ir reemplazando. Está enfrente. Bah. Enfrente está. Entonces sería no. next of, next to. El the hospital. Es está, vamos a ver. El hospital está en medio. Podríamos decirlo. Eh, between de it's green de gas station y the post office está en medio de ellos dos sí porque hay una hay una media calle ahí between and the gas station y te post office. Ajá. Y el último que era el de Shoe Store. 
¿Qué es esta? Es esta abajo. El supermarket. Under. Under the supermarket. What happened here? We're finished? We're finished. Really? Yes, I finished. Oh, very quick. Okay. All right. Okay, so I will see you in the main room in a moment. The the drugstore is on Are you guys finished? Hello, Hector, Jose, are you finished? Mm, yes. Can't, can't hear you. Yes? Okay. Um, I'm going to return you to the main room in a moment. Okay. Uh, let's see, shoe store is on the corner of Main and Second. Second Avenue. Yes. And Second. Next to the coffee shop or across the, the supermarket, too. Okay. Uh, next to the, the coffee shop. Next, next to the that could be another across from the movie theater Okay. Are you guys finished? Yes. Okay. All right. So let's try to figure out where these places are. So um, okay. So here, there's a city, and now we're looking at the park. So what can we say about the park? Where is the park? What are some things we can say about the park? 
on main street. But, but give me a sentence. Give me a sent complete sentences about the park. It is in the corner and First Avenue and my street. Okay, it's in the corner of Park Ab Park Park Street and Main Street. Good. Okay. What else can you tell me about the park? And there's something else you can tell me about the park? It's across from the movie theater. Yeah, very good. It's across from the movie theater. Excellent. Okay. All right. We can also say it's across from the department store. Department store. store. Mm -hmm. Good. Excellent. What can you tell me about the drugstore? It's on 2nd Avenue and next to the supermarket. Yeah. Okay. So... Where is the drugstore? Oh, yeah. Right there. Okay. We can say, yeah. Right there. Okay, so we can say that it's on the corner of Center Street and Second Avenue. What else can we say about the about the drugstore? It's next to the supermarket. Perfect. Yeah, it's next to the supermarket. And mm -hmm. in front of bookstore. <laughs> Yeah, very good. In front yeah. of the bookstore. Excellent. Okay. What can you say about the bookstore? It's on the, it's on the corner of Second and Center Street. Good. It's on the corner of Center Street and Second Avenue. What else? It's across from the post office. office. It's across from? The post office. The post office and? And yeah. across so across from the drugstore. Drug and across from the drugstore. Good. Mm -hmm. What can you tell me about the hospital? The hospital is on the corner of First Avenue and Center Street. Good, okay. Next to the post office and across from gas station. The gas yes. station. Sure, perfect. Yeah. So the hospital is right here, right? So it's on the corner of Center and First wow. Avenue. It's um, next to the post office and across mm -hmm. from the gas station. Excellent. What can you tell me about the uh, shoe store? It's on the corner of Main Street and Second Avenue mm -hmm. next to the coffee area. shop, across from the supermarket, and across from the movie theater. Excellent. Very good. Okay, so it's on the corner of 2nd Avenue, right? And Main Street. It's across from the movie theater and the supermarket. And it's next to the coffee the shop. Coffee shop. Yeah. Good. All right, bravo. You guys got it. Any qu any other questions? Oh, mm -hmm. Teacher. Yeah. Um, and then other words about directions, like for example, beside to, in front of, next to, or near. We can uh, use that word? Yeah, we can. Yeah. It's just that we're right now we're just sticking to the words that we've learned, right? So on the corner of, next to, in front of, um, between. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay, but but yes, you can use it, of course. Okay. Anything else? No? Okay. All right. So what we're going to do now, I want you to take a look at these places, these touristic places. Oh, sorry. Okay. A, I want you to take a look at these touristic places and tell me, what do you know about these places? So have what do you know about the Parthenon? That 
may, and I don't know if I'm wrong, but I think that is in Athenas. Okay. Uh, do you know how to say that in English? Hmm. It's located in, no, I don't know. Okay, so it's not in Rome, you're right. It's located in Athens. Uh, uh, Athens. Athens. Yeah, exactly. Okay. Athens. Okay. So we, we, we say Athens. All right. Um, All right. Okay, good. And do you know anything else about the Parthenon? Mm. No. No? No ideas about the Parthenon? No. So, okay, so the Parthenon is an ancient Greek temple. Yeah, it's a Greek temple. Okay. All right. What about this? Do we know where is the Pyramid of the Sun? I don't know. It's in Mexico or Peru, I guess. <laughs> yeah. Very I good. So too. <laughs> uh, sorry? I think so. Uh, you think what? I'm not sure if it's I, I don't sure if it's in is it located in on Mexico or if it's located um Peru. But I think that is an, an ancient construction mm -hmm. from the the from the Maya people, Maya people, I guess. I don't know. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah, I guess. Yeah, very good. So it is in, in, in Mexico. Yeah. It, yeah, it's actually um, located in Teotihuacan. Teotihuacan. You get it? Mm -hmm. uh, yeah, very good. And all right. Anything else that you know about it? Mm. So it's like a, it's um it's almost like two thousand years old. So it's two thousand. Really, yeah, two thousand. Two thousand. This mm -hmm. is where um the people I don't know. It's a sacrifice place, I guess. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe, yeah, it's possible. Okay, next. Uh, the Forbidden City. Do you know where that is? I don't know, but it's uh, about nice. a Shan culture, I guess. Hmm? I think it's yes, in like China. Or uh, yes, yes, China. 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 Yes, very know. good. The Forbidden City is in China. Do you know what is the Forbidden City? I don't know. Well, Any idea? That is, not, that is not needed to to go. It, it was. It wasn't. It wasn't um, permitted to go for for many pity people. But that was before. Do you know why? I think because it was where the nobility live yeah it was yeah exactly so that was where the emperor yeah. the emperor lived in the forbidden city okay so um, it's, a, it's a palace in beijing yeah beijing. yeah beijing. beijing so that before that's where the emperor lived and that's why that's why it's called the forbidden city because um you know just um, the emperor and, and yes and and it's and the noble people and the the people that serve the emperor could could be mm. okay all right the golden gate bridge what do we know mm. about the golden gate bridge usa, USA. 
Yeah, it's located in San Francisco. Yeah. San Francisco. Yeah. Very good. It's located in San Francisco. I've read Why a lot about this, but right now, uh, I don't remember too much. I only remember that the engineer have a lot of work to do and the, the, the how do I say cables? The cable. lines, the lines we see, cable. the lines we see, or oh, cable, uh, is not a solid cable. Mm -hmm. It's a lot of cable to make um, uh, a, lot, a greater cable mm -hmm. to support to support the the Golden State Bridge, and it was uh, I, um it, it is actually one of the seven uh how do I say this? wonders of the uh, wonder of the world. Yes. Yes. Mm -hmm. Yes. Very good. Very very good. So the Golden right. Gate. Yeah, you're absolutely right. It's actually um it's one of the most famous suspension bridges in the world okay yeah so yeah very good very very good okay good uh what about the red square i think maybe it's a palace in in india the palace in india um, russia very russia. good it's russia not so it was, we pronounce it ra, Russia, not Russia, Russia. but Russia. Yes. Russia. Okay, Russia. good. So Russia. what about, what is the square, red square? Moscow. In, okay, in English? Moscow. It, yeah, it's in Moscow. 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 Yeah, very good. Moscow. Moscow. <laughs> Yeah, very good. Um, so it's queer. Yeah, and it's in. Sorry, huh? No, no. It it sounds queer. What? In Moscow. Moscow. <laughs> yeah. It sounds it sounds weird. Yes. Why Why does it sound weird? ¿A qué le suena? A mosca. A mosca. <laughs> oh. <laughs> No, like a cow, like cow. It's more like a cow. Like uh, una, una, como, como vaca, cow. Moscow. Moscow. Yeah. Um yeah, so this is um it, it's on the walls of, of Gremlin. Uh, do you know what is Gremlin? No, I, I don't know. I think it's a, an organization from the politics. Yeah, very good. Um, exactly. Um, yeah, it's it's basically all of the the palaces um that that make like the 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 political um buildings. Okay. Um, that okay, was before. Um, the residence of the 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 former Russian emperor. Okay. Okay. All right. Very good. And the last one, Copacabana Beach. What do you know about Copacabana? Brazil. Yes, very good. Copacabana is in Brazil. What Brazil. part of Brazil? Cuba. <laughs> what part of Brazil? No, not Cuba. It's and Brazil. Actually, we pronounce it Cuba, not Cuba. So, what part of Brazil? I don't know. Havana is in Cuba. Yes. <laughs> I think it's in Las well, Brazil only have beach around the Atlantic Ocean, mm -hmm. right? Yeah. Sorry, could you repeat that? The beach on Brazil mm -hmm. are all on the Atlantic Ocean, 
Ocean. Anna, ocean. 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 Atlantic Ocean, right? yes. Mm -hmm. Yes. Yes. Uh, yes, you're absolutely right. Yes. So, so what part of Brazil is it? I don't know. Uh, Sao Paulo? Mm, nope. The most yeah Rio de Janeiro oh, it's Rio it's Rio. it's it's the most famous let's say beach in oh. Rio de Janeiro yeah very very famous um um and basically yeah so basically um uh, whenever you see the beaches uh the beach um of Rio mm -hmm. de Janeiro they will they will show Copacabana. That's like the most famous one, right? It's like in a U shape, like a like a horse shape kind of thing. Okay. Yeah. Okay. All right. Okay. Very good. So, have has anybody ever been to any of these places? No. No. Nobody has ever been to any of these places? No. Would you like to go to any of these places? Yes. Yes, which ones? Which ones are you interested in going to? Maybe the Forbidden City and the Golden Gate Bridge. The Forbidden City and the Golden, the Golden Gate, Bridge. Gate Bridge. Okay, all right. What about the rest of you? Are you interested in going to any one of these? Uh, to the para Pirana of the Sun. I guess it's um, an interesting place to go. Okay, the Pyramid of the Sun. Okay, all right. Anything else? No? Okay. Maybe Copacabana Beach too. Yeah, Copacabana. Okay, good. All right, so now let's have this conversation between a tourist and a woman. I want you to listen and repeat the conversation. Are you ready? Yes. Okay. Yes. yes. All right, here we go. Excuse me, ma'am. Excuse, Excuse me, ma'am. Excuse me, ma'am. Can you help me? Can you help me? Can you help me? How do I get... Oh, how do I get, how do I get? to St. Patrick's Cathedral? To St. Patrick's Cathedral. St. Patrick's. St. Patrick's Cathedral. 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 Just walk up Fifth Avenue. Just, just walk up Avenue. 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 To, uh, to 50th Street. To 50th Street. St. Patrick's is on the right. St. Patrick's, St. Patrick's is, is on the right. St. Patrick's is on the right. Is it near Rockefeller Center? It's in the earth. Near Rockefeller Center. Center. Yes, it's right across from. Yes, yes, yes. right across from. Rockefeller Center. Rockefeller, Rockefeller Center. Center. Thank you. Thank, Thank you. you. Thank you. Thank you. And where is the Empire State Building? And where, and where is the Empire State, State Building? State Building. It, is it far from here? Is it far from here? Far from here? It's right behind you. It's, it's right, right, right behind you. Just turn around and look up. Just, Just turn, around turn around and look up. up. Good. All right. Bravo. Excellent. What city 
are they in? New York City, I guess. Yeah, very good. They're in New York City. They're talking about St. Patrick's Cathedral, the Rockefeller Center, Empire State Center. That's definitely um, New York City. Okay, so I want you to practice this conversation with a partner. Um, so I'm going to send you in this in the chat this conversation. Okay. Do you see? Do you see it? Yes. Okay. Yes. Good. So you're going to practice this conversation with a partner. So, but I want to make sure that everybody's here to practice. So, Walter, are you here to practice? Walter? Hello, Walter? Hello, Walter? Walter? No está, okay. Jose Alberto, are you there? Okay. Yeah, you can participate? Okay. Yes. Yes, Jose yes. Alberto. Okay, perfect. Okay. Brian Enrique. Are you there? Henry. <sighs> yes. Sorry. I don't know why. No sé. Veo su nombre y automáticamente. I'm so sorry. I really am. Okay. <laughs> All right. So you you are able to participate. Okay. All right. Uh Rocio Jasmine. Are you are you there to participate? Yes, yes, teacher. Okay, perfect. All right, so um, let me just see how we can create these groups. Okay. Okay, so I'm going to open up the 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 groups and I want you to practice the conversation. Here we go. Walter? St. Patrick's is on the right. Is it near Rockefeller Center? Yes, it's right across from Rockefeller Center. Thank you. And uh, what is the Empire State Building? Is it far from here? It's right behind you. Just turn around and look up. Okay. Right I'll behind. Go. Behind. Behind. Yeah, behind. Behind. Thank mm -hmm. you. You're welcome. Ahora comienza. Excuse me, man. Can you help me? How do you uh, get to St. Patrick's Cathedral? Just walk out fifth. Fifth Avenue to 50th Street, uh, St. Patrick's, it's on the right. Mm -hmm. 
It is near Rotter. So same same Patrick's. What? Saint uh, Patrick's. Saint Patrick's. Yes. Yeah, okay. Patrick. Saint Patrick's on the right. Okay. Is it near Rockefeller Center? The street. Mr. Patrick is on the right. Is it near Rockefeller Center? Yes, it's right across from Rockefeller Center. Thank you. And where is the Empire State Building? It's right behind your your store your store around in the look out. We are finished, Miss. Hay ciertas palabras que no, no mucho, pero ya le voy a preguntar a la ticha. What questions do you have, Hector? Yeah, teacher, mm -hmm. uh, I have a question. Uh, yeah. The pronunciation, build, building or? Building. Building. Building, yes, building. Building, oh, mm -hmm. thank you. You're welcome. What other words do you have questions about? The uh, uh, question teacher is referent to uh, vegging or vegging. Oh, they say woman is right. Behind. Oh, behind. Behind. Okay. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Any other questions? Hi. Mm -hmm. No, teacher, yo, por mi parte, no. Okay. Other questions, Rocio? Yes, is number Rockel Fire Building? A uh, Rockefeller. Rockefeller. Yes. Okay, okay. Thank you, Miss. You're welcome. Anything else? No? No, teacher. You sure? Okay. All right. Okay, we're going to return to the main room. Okay. All right, guys and girls, are you ready? Yeah? Yes, we are ready. Perfect. Do you have any questions about the vocabulary? Yes. You have questions? Okay, what questions do you have? The pronunciation of ST. That's street. Yeah. Uh, oh, oh, sorry, sorry, sorry. Okay, it, it could be street, but in this case, it's saint. 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 
it's a it's a it's abbreviation for the word saint okay okay, okay. so uh, so there are two let's say that there are two ways that we can abbreviate this okay so one okay. can be st um can mean street a moment okay but in this case it means it's an abbreviation for saint so you're going to have to look at the context Okay. Does that make sense? Yes. Yeah. Okay. All right. No questions? Teacher. Mm -hmm. Repeat. Catedral, por Este, ¿cómo decirlo? Eh, ask me in English. Ask me in English. Uh, how do you pronounce? How do you pronounce? Eh, catedral. catedral in English. You say cathedral. Cathedral. Okay, cathedral. Okay, thank you. You're welcome. Anything else? Anything else? I think Brian is asking for something in the chat. Oh, what? You, you want the pronunciation or the meaning? Meaning is a piece of something. Uh -huh. Yeah. So you want the pronunciation? I guess. Okay. So the pronunciation is building. Building. Okay. Teacher. Mm hmm but that word uh, we can use that word from to I guess in Spanish is construir to build, and building is a in Spanish edificio. See, uh, is that okay? Correct or not? Sorry, what is the question I, again? I think uh, it's for the context. I guess uh, no, the, the, we can use build and building. Yes, and when when. We are using build, the verb build mm -hmm. is when well, Spanish is construir, I guess. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And when we say building, it's a edificio en español, I guess. Right. So uh, that's, that's yeah. a noun, and we identify nouns because we use a, for example, a building, um, the, the building. Right, so a building is un edificio. The building, el edificio. So you the know, build. you know that that it's a noun. Uh, and when we say we build a house, mm -hmm. is a noun. Yeah, we 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 build the house. Yeah, yeah, it's correct. It's for the context, I I, I guess. Mm -hmm. Well, no, not really the context. It's 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 how you use the word because a okay. building a a means that no. it's a noun. That's a noun. Yeah. And if you're using it after a subject, then it's a verb. Like we are building a house. Mm -hmm. We are building. So actually we're using an auxiliary there. 
we are building. So you know that 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 building is is a verb. Okay, thank. And mm -hmm. it's a real irregular verb. Mm -hmm. mm, no. Irregular. In, in this, uh, so in this case, so just we're just putting ing. Okay, build. Building. It's irregular in past. Yes, yes, but but building is ing. It's not the past. Ing. Um. It's it's the the present, uh, progressive form. Yeah. So don't you don't have to worry about being regular or irregular. You just put ing. That's it. Don't 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 worry about that. Is it like a bird fish can be pescado and también pescar fishing mm -hmm. fish. Right. También exactly. es el verbo. Uh, Ordeñar, que es milk, en que viene. Yeah, or water. Uh -huh. oh. Water, water is a verb too. To water the plants. I need to water the plants. Yeah, do you understand water the plants? Yes. Yeah, Rega, regar las plantas, right? So, yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Okay. Like iron can be hierro and planchar iron. Iron. Yeah, exactly. Hay mucho verbo exactly. Yes, absolutely. You're right about that. Okay. Any other questions that you guys have? No, we're good. Any other questions? Okay. All right, so please tell me if you can see my screen. Yes. Yes. Yeah, okay. So here we're going to be looking at um, how to give directions, okay? How to give directions. So how do we give directions? Very simple. For example, how do I get to Rockefeller Center? So we're always going to be using um, this uh, structure. How do I get to? How do I get to? So you can use this for many, many things. How do I get to um it, how do I get to um I don't know the the bank? How do I get to um a mercado exportel? How do I get to the airport, et cetera, et cetera, et cetera? Okay. So that's what, how we're going to start. Or you can also say, how can I get to? So that's the other one. How can I get to? Okay. Okay. Now, how, we, how are you going to answer? Well, you can say, walk up or go up. It means to, to walk in in a in the direction of a hill for example go up rockefeller center sorry 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 go up fifth avenue or walk up fifth avenue it's como subir yeah mm -hmm. exactly okay so it means a, yeah to to walk up in that direction up Okay, like you're like a hill. Okay. Teacher, mm -hmm. eh, una palabra que no he visto aquí en esta, que hemos aprendido es stride. Por ejemplo, para decir recto, aunque stride tiene mucho significado. Yes. Pero para decir derecho, por ejemplo, go stride, go stride. en una calle que te vaya recto, yeah. podemos 
We can, yeah, we so can say go straight to. Yeah, straight. Okay. Okay. Uh, so this one is more like like when when there's a hill, right? A little bit of a hill. So it goes goes go up. Okay, or walk up. Okay. So sure. Uh, it could be interpreted if I am, for example, in the first avenue and I have to go up to the fifth avenue. Uh, that makes sense. Sorry, could you ask the question again? Uh, if it, if it could be interpreted, I use the walk up or go up. If I am in the first avenue, and I have to go up to the fifth avenue, it could be right. Yeah, yeah, that's possible too. Yeah. Okay. And and you can also go in the opposite direction, walk down or go down, right? So if you have a hill, you go up, okay? You go up or you, or you walk up. And if, if you're going down the hill, so you walk down or you go down, okay? Is that pretty clear okay. for everybody? Yes. Yeah. Okay, so we, we can walk up or we can go up. And the opposite is walk down or go down. Okay, now we can also turn, right? So turn means to uh, change directions. So we can turn left, okay? Turn left is this way, okay? on 49th Street, or the opposite is turn right, which is this way. Okay. Does that make sense? Yes. Yeah? Yeah. Okay, good. Let's go on to the next one. You can also, then you can say where you're gonna find it where if you, after you move in, you can say where is, you're gonna find it. And you can say it's on the right or the opposite, it's on the left. How would you say that it's on the right or it's on the left? How do you say that? Está a la izquierda o la derecha? Mm -hmm. Está a la izquierda o está a la derecha? Yeah, exactly. Okay, sounds good? Yes. Yeah. Any questions about that? Do you need me to send this to the group? Uh, no. No? Not necessary? Okay. All right. So let me stop sharing. And what you'll do, so of course you're going to be using. Okay, so um, you're going to be using this um, map now to guide you. Uh, please tell me if you can see the map. Yes. Yes. Okay. So this is a map of New York City. Okay. This is a map of New York City. And what I want you to do is you're going to be working with a partner and you're going to be asking how to get to different places on this map. Okay. For example, excuse me, how do, do I get to the Empire State Building? Um, and when it says walk up 42nd street, turn blah, blah, blah. So how, where are you going to start? You're going to start from here. You're at the Grand Central Terminal right there. Like, you know, one of those signs where it says you are here. Okay, so this is right there. 
This is where we are. You are here. So this is where we're gonna start. Okay, and you're gonna be asking your partner for directions. Sounds good? Sounds good. Yeah? Any questions about this? I guess I'm going to get lost. You want to get lost? Yes. <laughs> okay. Well, in New York City, I guess it's easy to get lost. Okay. I get lost in El Salvador. <laughs> well, that's true. But in El Salvador, it, the, the directions are even worse, right? It's like... In, in El Salvador, it's like the the direct the directions are like for example, it's um it's a you know like in front of Salvador del Mundo, you're like Salvador del Mundo. Like I mean, my goodness, it's like huge, right? Salvador del Mundo is huge. So in front of like what which direction where, right? Or for example, they just say, you know, it's uh, next to the greenhouse. There's so many greenhouses, right? So yeah, and, and I think in El Salvador, it's very easy to get, um, to get lost. Okay, so uh, any questions at this moment? No. No? Okay, so... So remember, you are going to pretend to be a tourist that is at the Grand Station Square. Or Grand, sorry, Grand Bus Station, I think it is, or something like that. And um, you're going to be asking for directions. Okay. And, oops, sorry. I'm, I'm trying to send it to you. Hold on. Okay. All right, so do we understand what to do? Yes. And so remember, you have to use words like go up, go oh, walk straight, go down or uh, or walk down, uh, turn left, turn right. Um, it's on the left, it's on the right, okay? All right, so let's, um, so I'm going to make groups again. Okay. And I'm going to give you about six minutes. I think we have about six minutes. Okay. So about three minutes you can you can take turns. So three minutes for one person and three minutes for the other person. Okay. Sounds good. Everybody, yes. everybody understands what you're gonna be doing. Yes. Yeah. Okay. Yes. All right, let's open the rooms then. Está entrando ella, pues si tengo dudas. Ahí está. Teacher, I have a question. Yeah. What's your question? Con exercise. 
que vamos a realizar con el compañero. Uh -huh. eh, vamos a llenar lo que nos compartió ahí o referente a lo que nos estaba comentando. Porque no, 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 no nos quedó muy, muy claro. So you're going, do you, okay, read the instructions. What does it say? What do the instructions say? Hector? Yeah. What, yeah. what do the instructions say? Oh, look, look, look at the instructions of the exercise. Sí, sí, sí. O sea, yo tengo aquí impreso lo de lo del manual. Okay. What does it say? Read it to me. Vaya, este, con lo de referente aquí a, a, la, a las direcciones. O sea, no, no, no le, no le entendimos con but, el compañero. Léamelo, léamelo. ¿Qué es lo que dice? Uh, excuse me. Mm -hmm. How do I get? No, 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 no. The the instructions. They say imagine. Imagine you are. En la imagen yes. que le acaba de mandar. ¿Qué dice? Que uh, imaginemos que somos un turista. Y estamos en la uh, terminal de la catedral. Uh -huh. Grand Central Terminal. Y dice que debemos preguntar por direcciones. Uh -huh. Ah, vaya. O es sea, que yo le estaba leyendo solo el literal A y, y yo así con el literal B, pero no me había yes. tratado lo, lo demás. Yeah, that's why I was asking you. What, does, what do the instructions say? Okay, so always look at the instructions. Follow the instructions. Okay. Ah, okay. O sea, okay. Que nosotros podemos decir este, por dónde queda, por un ejemplo, el Hospital Bloom. No tenemos que dar la dirección. No, using the map. Ah, okay. Usando, usando el mapa del que tenemos en la imagen. Exactly. Yeah. Oh, okay. Okay. You okay. are in New York, not in El Salvador. In New York. Okay. Okay. Well, okay. 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 Thanks, teacher. Right. You're welcome. Thank you. Bye. Entonces, en referente a lo que está en el mapa. Police is back in. A hand for his back in. Three for his back in. And go, is it in go? Is uh, turn left? Main Street, Madison Avenue. Which is the calle principal, I imagine. Um, to to right. Ah, me lleva el diablo. Sorry. Why? Por. <laughs> me lo lleva el diablo. Es que vamos ir recto. Siguiendo la flecha, como es la indicación. Ajá. Y nos vamos a ir por la calle Madison, ah, por la calle, por la avenida Madison. Ajá. Y vamos a doblar hasta llegar a, a Empire State Building. Uh -huh. Ahora solo me falta decirlo en inglés. Uh -huh. <laughs> Don't complicate yourself, just say, go up. Go, go back, down, um, turn go back, left, turn right. Go up, 42, 40, 
second? Forty second, no. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you're right. Forty second Street. Mm -hmm. And to left. Okay. To the left, Madison Avenue. Mm -hmm. And and to and to right. Pero ese pequeño doble se hace allí, digo yo otra vez. To left. And the Empire State is in front of you. Okay. Good. Yeah. Continue bueno, practicing. Es la, la idea es <laughs> yeah. Very good. Yeah. Continue practicing. You, you got it. Bueno, pero ahí me dice que solo voy a buscar ir hasta el nomás al Empire, pero ya no me dice si voy a seguir al Bryan Park, a New York. No, yes, you, ha you have to ask for different directions. So the ah. Bryan Park, New York Public Library, St. Patrick's Cathedral, blah, 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 blah. Si es posible a dar la vuelta y llegar siempre a la terminal central. Mm -hmm. Exactly. No. Uh, I understand. Well, no, no, you don't have to go back to the Grand Central Terminal. Just, just get there. Eh, I, I... Si quiero tomar, si quiero tomar un atajo. <laughs> I, I don't know. I've, I've, I've never been to New York City, to be honest. Yo creo que no existe en inglés la palabra va bien. Atajo, como un shortcut. camino corto. It's called Imagino a shortcut. Shortcut. Shortcut, yes. I'll, I'll write in the chat. Shortcut. Entonces, entonces nos meteríamos de un solo en la 42 But in English, street. in English, in English. Correcto. 42. Shortcut. 40 seconds. Ah. 42 seconds street. Pero si siguiendo la flecha del buyer, iríamos... Eh, doblaríamos porque llegaríamos enfrente okay. entonces doblaríamos but, a la izquierda I, y ese sería ajá pero igual en inglés doblar no and, and turn left yes good and turn left and and go up mm -hmm. uh, y doblar and turn, le and turn left near 42 second street 42 no Ah, 42 seconds. 40 seconds. Estoy hablando Spanglish. Yes, I noticed. Uh, y hasta llegar a New York Public Library or Library. Yeah. yeah. Very good. Continue like that, but in English. I need you to continue okay. in English, okay? Okay. Okay, I'm gonna go to see another group. Continue like that. Okay. Así sería. Cabal, sí. Sí va. Sí. Turn left or turn right on Sixth Avenue. Sixth Avenue. Turn right on. Turn. Turn right. Um, this is a real turn left on Six Avenue. Seven, you know, I mean, I'm a question, también, no crea. Siento que me quedo. Sí, you're no. doing good. You're doing good, Hector. Just, just continue, just the way you are. You're doing good. Okay. 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 Thanks. You're welcome.
Okay. Hey. Uh, ¿Tiene apagado el micrófono? I have a bad connection of internet. I freezing <laughs> in another room. I want to keep it. Okay, but vamos a practicar entonces. So the question is, how do I get to the Saint Patrick's Cathedral? Cathedral. Sa what? Cathedral. Cathedral. Um, <laughs> me cuesta un poco con eso. Cathedral. It's okay. Yeah, you can. The more you you practice, you will get it. Cathedral. <laughs> cathedral. Mm -hmm. Cathedral. Cathedral. Yeah. Okay. I think we'll walk up, walk up on um, 40, 40 seconds street. Nah. Turn, turn right on Madison Avenue. Walk three, four, five, six, seven. Walk seven blocks and turn left on 50th Street. Ah, um, very good, very good. Okay. Um. Now, ask me. Ask me the for for the region. Okay. All right, guys and girls. So uh, I saw that many of you were, were practicing. That's very, very good. Now, be careful with the, the, the names of the roads, for example, or the streets, better said. You say 42nd Street, not 42. 42 Street? No, it's 42nd, 45th. 49th, okay, a 41st, 43rd, okay, so we use ordinal numbers, okay, all right, but very, very good, excellent, um, chicos, yo sé que a veces tenemos esa tendencia de decir, por ejemplo, es que a mí me cuesta, um, algo que es bien importante grabarse en la mente, es esto, que la mente es poderosa. Y lo que nosotros le decimos a la mente, la mente lo cree. Así que si nosotros le decimos a la mente, ah, es que me cuesta, la mente va a decir, ah, pues sí me cuesta. Si decimos a la mente, no es que esto, esto lo puedo hacer. Esto es, esto es algo, como dicen, pan comido. La Yo mente lo Yeah, you can do it. La mente lo va a creer. La mente es muy poderosa. Entonces, necesito que ustedes empiecen a trabajar en decirse cosas positivas. No negativas. No que, ay, me cuesta. Ay, no, es que, es que yo no soy buena para, para, para en el inglés. Ay, es que yo nu nunca he podido hab hablar inglés etcétera, etcétera. Ese tipo de frases 
lejos de ayudarle, lo está haciendo que haga un retroceso. Entonces, digámonos, digámonos cosas positivas y al final va a ser positiva la, 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 el resultado. ¿Ok? Ok, so we have a few minutes left. And for these few minutes, we're going to start with a new topic here. So this new topic is vocabulary. Eight, top eight things people hate to do. The first one is stand in line. Do you understand stand in line? I hate to. <laughs> stand I, in hate. Line. I know. Me too. Yeah, I know. It's it's boring and, and especially if you're tired. Right, stand in line. So everybody repeat after me, stand in line. Stand in line. Mm -hmm. Good. Stand in line. Do stand laundry. Line. Very good, yes. Do laundry. Do laundry. Do laundry. Do laundry. Do Do laundry. laundry. Do laundry. Mm -hmm. Good. Travel to work. Do travel, travel to work. 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 Travel to work. Travel, Travel to work. Go to meetings. Go to meetings. Go to meetings. Go to meetings. Exercise. 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 Work in the yard. Work, work in the yard. In the yard. Work, in work in the yard. Work in the yard. Clean the house. Clean the house. Clean the house. Clean the house. Mm -hmm. Clean the house. Clean the house. Open the mail. 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 Okay. Mail. Mail, yes. Do you have questions about the vocabulary? Vocabulary first. Do you have questions about the vocabulary? No. The meaning, the meaning of the words. No. No? No? Okay. No. What about the pronunciation? Do you have questions about pronunciation? Stand in line. Yeah. Stand in line. Uh, it, stand in line is more common, especially like in, in the United States. Um, but we can also say in British English, we say stand in the queue. The queue. Okay. The queue. So the queue, it means the same thing as the line. Okay. How do you write this? Huh? How do you write this? Q. Yes? The Q. Mm -hmm. yeah. yeah. Okay. Stand in... The queue. Mm -hmm. All right. Okay. Any other word? Any other words uh, you want? The pronunciation? Um, pronunciation of is laundry or laundry? I don't know. Laundry. 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 Yeah, so not laundry. Laundry, no, it's laundry. Laundry. Uh, mm -hmm. Yeah. Okay. So which of these things do you hate to do? Which of these things do you hate to do? Stand in line. Stand in line. Okay. Anything else? Go to meetings. I Go hate to meetings. Very, very boring. Mm. Yeah, I understand. Yes. Travel to work. Travel to Travel work. Is, is a, a long trip. Yeah, I bet. How long? 
uh, an hour. Ah, okay. Okay. Anything else? Mm. Well, you need that? And open the mail, open the mail. Yes. And open the mail. Hmm. Interesting. Okay. Any other things that are not here that you hate to do? Go to work. <laughs> <laughs> I hear you. Teacher, how do you say planchar ropa? Ah, iron. Iron. Iron, mm -hmm. iron the clothes. I think I don't say clothes. Okay. Mm. I don't like it. Yeah, I understand. I can, but I don't like it. But you don't like it. Okay. All right. I think driving to to do the uh, the grocery. The groceries. It, mm. It's okay. frustrating with the traffic. Mm. Okay. Mm. Yeah, it's true. Okay. Okay. Well, guys, we're going to stop sharing there. Okay. And we're going to continue this topic next class, which is going to be when? In um, August 10. Um, are you August. sure? Let me check. Eleven. Mm -hmm. Exactly. Yeah. Yeah. Eh, ya pasé la consulta de ustedes acerca del último día de clase. Ya, se, ya las pasé a la persona, el coordinador y, o sea, el coordinador de todo el programa y me dijeron de que lo iba a pasar al coordinador de este programa. Entonces, eh, todavía estoy en espera para ver qué, qué resuelven y después les vamos a avisar, ¿ok? Ok. Uh -huh. okay. okay. Bueno. Ok, así de que espero que... Bueno, sí, no, no creo que vamos a tener entonces la, la casa del 14, así que no se preocupen por eso. Ok. Ok, bueno. So, I hope you have a wonderful um, vacation. And I will see you in after the vacation. Okay? So, so we don't have vacation, okay. teacher. No? We, have, we don't have vacation. Uh, no. I'm sorry. We don't have. <laughs> not, not all of us. Oh, uh, really? Why? Just yes. Maximiliano had a vacation. No. Oh. I don't have a vacation. I don't have a vacation. Why Maximiliano? No. We have to work. Ah, okay. At six. You have to work at six. Okay. I guess. But. Yeah, I know. It's life. But we yes. have a good vacation, teacher. Hmm? We have good vacation teacher yeah but you know you mm -hmm. still have vacation from from classes yes. so you can go the on your free days you can go to the beach so that's a vacation oh. yes right so yeah enjoy it okay I'll so do. enjoy okay. your vacation and i will see you after the vacation okay okay all right. Thank you. Take care, guys. All right. Bye. 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 Thank you. Bye. 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 Bye.